Hello everyone, I am Shweta Jain and in this video, we will learn about frame representation in artificial intelligence. Frame representation is a knowledge representation technique that we used in the artificial intelligence and there are some other representation techniques such as logical representation, semantic networks and production rules and frame representation. In this video, we will only learn about the frame representation technique. And uh, so what is the meaning of frames? Frames is an AI data structure that represent a knowledge about a particular object or concept and this concept or a situation. And this was first proposed by the Marvin Miski in the 1970s. And frames consist of collection of slots and slot values. This can be understood that let's take an example that uh, uh, there is a railway frame, railway ticket and which can be considered as a frame. And it has a slots, slots like passenger name, distance, journey and destination. So it can contain um, different values. And uh, it uh, is also known as a slot filter technique in artificial intelligence and uh, it is resembled to the uh, traditional record like structure. And uh, an important term in the uh, frame based system, uh, facet. Facet uh, means to provide extended knowledge about attribute of a frame and it can uh, consider sometimes it is known as a slot and it can contain name values or slots and facets are used to establish the attribute value and tell the inference engine how to process the attribute let's take an example of a frame of a book and here we have make a frame of artificial intelligence um, frame and it have slot and filters and it, slot can contain as many values uh, title genre author addition year page these are slots and it can contain as its values related values so that we can make inference that it is a artificial intelligence frame book and p uh, author is a peter norwick and uh, let's another example uh, of boarding pass frame uh, boarding pass in this also boarding pass frames there are fixed format of frames and there can be many frames like this uh, here Qantas boarding pass and air new zealand boarding pass are the examples and this contain many slots carrier name flight date seat from to and its contain values. So here we have knowledge about the boarding pass frames and we can make the system that it representing the knowledge. And uh, the frame based system has uh, many frames and um, it is connected to the pointers and frame based system general use as, as compared to the uh, single we have taken frame of a book. So uh, here two frames are there debit where and when and they are all already connected to the pointer and we can make a knowledge that debit is a farmer debit own pain and debit likes fruit and uh, another frame we make a frame that what is ban so ban is a dog ban head hates cat so uh, the uh, frame based system can contain as many frames there are certain advantages of frame that frame knowledge representation uh, makes easier to grouping the related data and uh, frame can be represented comparably flexible uh, as compared to other knowledge representation technique and uh, there are many application in artificial intelligence too that such as natural language processing and uh, uh, it is very easy to add new slots. If we want to add further new slots, we can easy easy to uh, add another slots. There are certain disadvantages of flat 
frame representation also that frame representation has much generalized approach generalized approach uh, let's understand through an example that we have a frame of classroom and uh, uh, it has different professors so we make a different frame of professor but if you want to add maintenance worker information in the professor frame so we cannot add into this as it is uh, made for professor so it approaches for generalized approach as compared to the specific approach and uh, frame system inference mechanism is not easily processed so it is difficult to make inferences from the frame so in this video you will you learn about frame based system and i hope you understand the topic of the frame based system